many of you have written in the comments or direct message me and you said, hey, does wearing a condom prevent the spread of genital herpes? Meaning if I wear a condom, will it keep me from getting it? If I wear a condom and I have genital herpes, will it keep my partner from getting it? I'm gonna answer that question today. Guys, I'm Dr. Jen, it's good to see you. Okay, quick reminder, genital herpes is caused by HSV1 and HSV2. HSV stands for herpes simplex virus, okay? Now, the way that you get herpes simplex virus is that it's spread through direct contact with herpes sores, uh, usually during sex, that's vaginal, oral, or anal sex. But HSV, the virus, can also sort of be present on the skin of an infected person, even if they don't have any sores, okay? So if another person comes into contact with a virus on an infected person's skin, the other person can actually become infected. So now let's go back and answer the question. Do condoms prevent the spread of genital herpes? Well, the answer is twofold. First of all, they lower the risk of transmission of genital herpes, but they don't completely eliminate the risk. Now, let me explain why this is. First of all, the herpes virus can live outside the area that a condom covers. A condom covers a specific area, but you can have virus in other parts of your body, other areas of skin. So the condom may not always prevent spread because it simply may not cover all the areas where the virus is. And as I said before, you can pass HSV, herpes simplex virus, to someone else even when you don't have sores. Uh, and the virus can be present on skin that looks normal. So I know you're saying, well, good googly moogly, what do I do? Well, there are a number of ways that you can lower the risk of transmission of genital herpes in general, okay? First thing is, yes, wear latex condoms every time and correctly every time. Even though it doesn't completely eliminate the risk, it lowers the risk and that is very, very important. The other thing is if you qualify, take viral suppression medications or have your partner take those um, if they've spoken to their doctor and it makes sense for them. Um, viral suppression medications can be very helpful. They're antiviral medications. The other thing is do not have any sex during outbreaks. Y'all hear me? No sex during outbreaks. And then the other things has to do with just sort of general um, uh, sort of good practices when it comes to being intimate with your partner. Be honest and open and upfront with your partner. You should always talk to your partners about their status. Um, you know, minimize your sexual partners because that will lower your risk of getting genital herpes. Make sure you're getting regularly checked for STDs. All of those things are going to be very important. Let me know if this was helpful. I'm Dr. Jen Caudill, practicing family physician, on your health expert and video creator. Check out my other videos on genital herpes. I will link them here. Um, please share this video with anyone who needs to hear it. Uh, on Facebook, I'm uh, I'm on Facebook. Please like and follow my page on um, on YouTube. Please subscribe to my channel. Click the little bell for updates. Also, I'm on TikTok and WhatsApp and Instagram and everything else at Dr. Jen Caudill. And then uh, please sign up for my weekly health newsletter at drjencaudill.com. Guys, I hope this. This is helpful. Stay safe.